Hey everybody, welcome back to Pixelmon. Uh, we are now running 3.01 and pillow swine time. Alright, hold up a second guys. I was going to show you this, but but I have a two minute clip of a mythical Mew catch. My first one actually, that I've been wanting to put into a video for a while. And it's going right here. Then we'll get back to that guy right there. So, enjoy this this Hello. joyful Mew capture. <laughs> well, 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 guys. Look what I found. So I have a crap ton of poke balls, and I am going to give this a try. <laughs> uh, let's see what a crunch does. Super effective, but. Not that much overall. Okay, if I crit this thing... Should have tried other attacks out. Okay, I think we're good. Bag. Pokeballs, I think. It looks like it's getting pretty dark out to me. <laughs> and this is just going to be a series of catch and release, catch and release. If I get it on this first ball, though, I'm going to be <laughs> simply amazed. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> Holy crap, guys! <laughs> Actually, hold on a sec. It's not raining in Minecraft. Yeah, <laughs> sorry about that. Uh, I actually have a uh, website that I listen to for rain like that. I really do like the sound of rain. Uh, anywho, um, reading on the forum forums that apparently people have been able to find pillow swine with ancient power, and that's how you get a mammal swine. And I freaking want a mammal swine. So this episode is going to be dedicated to my attempts and probably massive numbers of failures to getting a pillow swine that has ancient power. And evolving it into ah, evolving it into a mammal swine. I choose you, PC. All right. <laughs> and uh, if you notice, we're still cooking down some more saplings over there to finish off the uh, ethanol tanks from the previous episode. But yeah, got home. Uh, <laughs> kind of late today, actually, but updated the server, went to the forums immediately and looked for Mammal Swine, and that was a nice car that went by, and found out that people have posted that it does work in 3.0.1, you can find them, they are possible. So I don't actually... Oh, I, I was eating a potato! Man, that's a very, very rude... Sand slash. No, sand slash. Stupid thing. <laughs> uh, so yesterday, actually, I came over here, and I got a lot of ice off of this area. And yeah, look at that. All right, so these are swine nubs. We can't take one of these, even though they are the right level. Out of the way, swine nubs. Uh, looking at the stats, I mean, I, I guess there's some. Just some random chance that they're going to have ancient power. Is that a diglet all the way out on the ice? Or just a really... No, that's a really dinky pillow spine! Oh my god! Yeah, okay. Um... Printplup? Screw you, Printplup. I am after what looks like a giant diglet. <laughs> alright, alright, this is gonna be cool. This is gonna be cool. We're going to take out, um... He's level 20? Yeah, we'll take out this guy. Alright, alright, so... Don't really want to poison. Faint attack, although I think that's supposed to be F-E-I-N-T. Oh, not very useful. Let's do a quick attack. 
Alright, this guy just sucks. Fury Cutter. <laughs> well, I can't be hurt apparently. So far all I've seen is him use is... Use Fury Attack? Fury Cutter. So I've seen Odor, Mud Sleuth, or er, Odor Sleuth, Mud, and... Man, I'm really doing no damage. Mud bomb. That's the other one. Let me. I'm kind of worried here. So yeah, Jason and uh, Jason Bilbo are currently on the server. Uh, Six and RC were on there. They knew we were updating, but they have not yet returned. All right, all right. So. We are equal level. I'm going to wing attack. Oh, that did quite a bit of damage. Okay, so he has Fury Attack, Mud Bomb, and Odor Sleuth. If he has Ancient Power, that would be so awesome. Oh, I'm just going to try smacking it with a Dusk Ball. Come on. But I brought it back. I'm actually going to see if I can run. I might just try... Yeah. I might just try the old dust ball catch. Alright, come on, buddy. Yeah, yeah. I'm a master Pokemon. No! <laughs> I know the chances of this are, like, minimal, but... It'd be awesome to catch one that small, wouldn't it? <laughs> And I cannot tell you what's up. Uh, my connection is pretty good on the server, and I am just lagging. Like there is no tomorrow. Okay, so let's, uh... No, 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 no! You stop that, buddy. You stop that right now. Okay, so... This is what I want him to use. Ancient Power doesn't do that much damage to him. Oh, that's kind of high right there. Um, This is where I think we can go back to the Gligar. Yeah. Uh, we'll do just some quick attacks here. Oh, I did check. Uh, you cannot ride on the evolution of the Gligar. So that's a little disappointing. We'll have to find another uh, mountable Pokemon that doesn't take up, like, you know, the entire freaking screen. You will knock him into red? Knock him into red? Still no sign of ancient power, so I, I've pretty much given hope that this guy actually has it, but this will be a little bit of a proof of concept here. Mm -mm -mm. Plus, it would just be awesome if he did actually have it. Ow. Alright, still during the day. Oh, cool, I get to see the Pokeball. One wiggle? That's further than we usually make it. Two. No. I might swap out the turd wig here. Just for the health. <laughs> Is that two wiggles? Oh, oh. Ah. Oh. All right, let's uh, get turd wig. <laughs> and off the screen he goes. Barely any damage. Pokeballs, Dusk Ball. Oh, yes. One wiggle. Two wiggle. Three. Oh, got it. Got it. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we brought our PC. Mm -mm. Let's clear off the snow. <laughs> it is a pygmy. Alright, Fury Attack, Mud Bomb, Mud Sport, and Odor Sleuth. Also, okay, it did use both of the mud attacks, I just didn't notice it. Ah, well. Uh, let me just... Peck, Mud Sport, Endure, and Thrash. 
Okay guys, so I'm going to keep on looking for pillow swines, and I will clue you guys back in when we make a little progress. If we make any progress. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> hey guys, just wanted to take a quick update here. Um, I wanted to check out the moves here to make sure that we see some of the first starting moves. And this particular pillow swine, none of them. Uh, Enduring Ice Fang, Fury Attack, and Mist are all non-starters. Uh, However, what is a starter ability is Odor Sleuth and Mudsport. Those are two abilities that we saw the previous one uh, have. So I am hopeful that I will be able to have a good search. And there's a couple more pillow swine in this area. So yeah, look at some down there. So I'm going to keep on hunting. <laughs> I will talk to you guys again in a bit. Hmm. Powder Snow. That's a starter one, but it's also saying it's level 8. Hmm. Keep on looking. I see you guys in the distance. No. No. All right, guys. My last set of poke balls here. Come on. Oh. Last one. Alright, we'll have to make more ooh, more poke balls after this. Do it. I think so. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I went through all stack of 64 poke balls, and instead of doing one at a time, I didn't enter combat. I just went through the stack, and now. We can review them all. <laughs> oh, look at all that swine up or pillow swining. All right, so they stayed on the first page. That's a good thing. Oh, and this guy was a mistake. <laughs> I could not even see, did not even see him anywhere. All right, uh, that's a nub one and level forty, so that's a good to note. Odor sleuth nub level forty. Uh, Mud bomb is not. It's a level 18. Ice Fang is also not. That's a 24. Takedown is also not. The ones we're looking for specifically in Ancient Power, but they can also do Peck, um, Odor Sleuth, Mud Sport, and Powder Snow. Alright, so no to this guy. Let's uh, put him, set him free. Oh yeah, Ancient Power. Look at that, right there. And in Ordinary Growth, we got one. Ancient Power, Peck, Ice Wind, and Trash. One. <laughs> uh, let's check out this guy. Powder snow, mud bomb, take down thrash. Not one of our requirements. Stats. Oops. Peck, powder snow, mud slap, and mud bomb. So a couple of them there. But not ones we're looking for. Hey yo, set up. I am recording a swine. Hello, swine hunt. Alrighty, back to it. Uh, moves. Nope. Let's get rid of that one. Alright, moves. Fury attack, mud slap, mud sport, mist. That was that one, right? Yeah, okay. Let's uh, do this one here. Peck, mud sport. So it still had two. Uh, 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 done. I hope that was the right one. That wasn't the right one, was it? Yep, that wasn't the right one. Oi, alright, lower one, lower one here. Moves. Odor Sleuth Mud Sport, that has two again. Moves. Nope. Nope. Oh, nope. I'm starting to think I was really lucky. Oh, yeah, look at that. Okay, so this is our guy. Ancient power. Freaking awesome. Uh, let's put him in place of Rayquaza. And I think this might actually be my, come my main here. Let's just cycle these all down here. Oh, yeah. 
Well, you cannot do that, unfortunately, because to make it be a mammo swine, which is what I am after, it has to have ancient power as a pillow swine. Which is very rare. <laughs> I just caught two rows is six plus two minus one, so thirteen. Thirteen of varying levels. And one had ancient power. Oh yeah. <laughs> All right, let's pick up our thingy here, and we're just gonna let's take a, an assessment of our guy. Oh, he's sizable. He is sizable. Look at that. I think that's ordinary size too. Yeah, that's just ordinary. Serious nature. I don't know if serious is good or bad. Um, I still might look for like a huge one of these, but that's gonna be such a rare find. But for now, this is gonna be like our this is gonna be our first guy officially on the Dusk Ball team. Oh yeah. Alright, we need to level him up. We definitely need to level him up. And I can think of no easier way to level him up. Oh wait, wait, what moves does he have? <laughs> I'm so focused on the other one. Okay, so he has icy wind. Uh user attacks with a gust of chilled air, it also reduces the target speed. Uh, ice was doing really, really good against my Aerodactyl, so I think that's ice against ground or air. They evolve by leveling with ancient power. It's just an odd circumstance for that particular Pixelmon. All right, all right, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. Let's, uh, how uh, well, was that trappage? Eh. How about you, buddy? Where's a magma when you need one? Oh, Flygon, that'll do. All right, all right, so let's try, I'm just gonna try this guy. Icy wind. Oh, one shot it. Flygon speed was decreased. Critical hit, super effective. The flygon fainted. Oh man. What is? Okay, that's some pixelmon standing over in my jungle, or some buddy standing over in my jungle. Okay, let's see if we're also good up against Trapinch. We'll use Ice Wind again. Oh, one shot it. Target speed was decreased. Super effective. So I, I do think it's against uh, Rock and or Flying still, because I guess I don't really know if... Uh, are, the, are the Flygons Rock or just Flying? Oh, there's another Flygon. Let's do it. Do this. This is gonna be awesome. Oh yeah. Flygon used bide. Flygon bided this time, but Pillow Swine did not. Swooped in, slowed it down. Critical hit, super effective. Oh yeah. <laughs> We're getting closer. Level fourteen. I love these guys. I just wish they were nocturnal. I would definitely have a Larvesta on my team. I, I need to get out of the snow and back into the desert. What am I doing? I'm too excited. Alright, Doug Trio. So I'm getting the impression that my Ice Wind is going to pretty much take out anything that it hits in this desert. So I'm trying to pick the targets that are going to give me the uh, the best benefit. Uh, you guys may notice that the server is lagging quite a bit. Um, not sure exactly what's causing that, but that's going to make healing 
Whoa. Camera speed was decreased. Uh, tackle. Hmm. Let's try an ancient power. Not too bad. Peck. Also not too bad. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Swapping you out. Swapping you out, buddy. Whew. What was... Do you guys see that? It could have just been a big ladybug, or ladybug, but that was huge. Oh, no, there it is. Pig Knight? <laughs> um, I was with Jace when we hunted down a little fiery pig dude. I guess this is what it would evolve into. one of those siglyphs. Siglyphs, I mean. Not too bad, either. Alright, alright, so we're gonna do this kind of tricksy. We're gonna use, uh, Turdwig to level up the rest of the way. Oh, I almost thought it was a boss. Little dinky floating trap inch. Dinky Geo dude. It's gonna beat the crap out of that other one too. Oh, here's another one. One step away from the memo slide. Recording my memo slide. Um, you know what? Just because I want to see, have not caught one of these yet. Super effective. Pink. <laughs> Crunch. It's not effective. Death. <laughs> it wasn't effective. That's awesome. I was actually just guessing at that. <laughs> just because I thought it would be amusing if that's what it ended up being. Alright, Sandiles, Diglets. Man, you know, one Magmar would probably have leveled this guy. Maybe I should stop being selective. Let's just get this done. Because I kind of want dinner, and as I mentioned, I did get home late tonight. You know, I could just make a candy. Um, I do have golden apples back at my base, and I'm pretty sure that's like the base component for one of those candies. But I don't know, that just seems kind of cheating. <laughs> uh, plus, you know, we're almost there. Hope this isn't too boring. Whoa! Come back, guy! See, I gotta be very careful with him because I think he's on fire. Come on, you gotta be close. So I need maybe 4,000 more? Yeah, I think 4,000 more. And I hate how Escape does not close that screen. That is freaking annoying. Every other screen in the whole freaking world closes by hitting escape, except for that one. Oop, there's a sand shrew, or sand slash. Oh, not the world's greatest level. Oh, 
<laughs> Not very effective. I don't even think I saw my health dip. Alright, 400 XP. I just need anything of a high level at this point in time. And I'm trying to think of something that is a high level, but... See, these guys were not here during the day. So swine ups and pillow swines. Very happy. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Butt clinch. Butt clinch. Looks like somebody found my mind because they pillared on up out of it. I always fly out of it, so that's definitely not me. Whew, I just need to calm down for a moment. That was almost painful death. What the? Here's a Magnemite. like some level 40s which means I should go to an extreme hills ah, stop jumping me I can't get my other guy out there oh it's just lagging so badly it's painful to move anywhere but I'm running out of moves direction in extreme hills and a plains maybe we could find some uh, some of those kangaroo things and isn't the ravine around here somewhere oh I don't find pillow swine oh all right so there we go there's a why not clearly Here in the extreme hills. Oh, of which there's just rats behind us. Not the most <laughs> easily accessible extreme hills, apparently. Boy. I was gonna try something with that guy, but he's only level 19. I think the why nots, yeah, they're not that high of a level either. Dagar. Ah. Uh, invisible Matang. Why not? Man, it's lagging so bad. I wonder if this is because of the update. Is that a dinky little drift room? Oh, he's another uh, candidate for the uh, dust ball team, by the way. He comes out at night. Persian, nice. Whoa. All right, Pokemon Turdwig. Let's get us some nice XP here. Good old Razor Leaf. 
1,000, nothing yet. Go away, Ratata. Alright, a little bit more of an extreme hills peninsula here. I don't see too many Pokemon on it, though. As soon as that sun comes up, though, we're gonna get, like, a Fero explosion. Oh my god! Oh. My. God. A Litwick. Oh, and I don't have any Pokeballs. Oh. I feel so bad. No. Pokeballs. Oh. I'm just gonna just gonna feel sad just 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 a little bit we've been looking for those um Loquid really wants one and I also would really like one especially if they're a nocturnal those would be awesome they're a uh, psychic psychic fire or a ghost fire it might be a ghost fire uh, they feed off the souls of the living but they're also pretty cool looking Pokemon <laughs> I'll do an electrode, why not? Oh, come back! There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, come on, come on. That is some nasty lag. Ah, finally, I thought maybe it got into combat with the other guy. Alright, so, Pillow Swine. No effect. Razor Leaf. Even if it's crappy, it'll still kill it. Pillow Swine has gone to level 50. This is it, guys. This is it. Whew, just gonna take a moment. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! <laughs> here he goes, here he goes! Let me remove my... Oh, I can't even get rid of the UI or anything. <laughs> oh yeah! <gasps> Pillow swine evolved into mammal swine. <laughs> oh, memo swine. <laughs> oh yeah, that was awesome. That was freaking awesome. All right, all right. Let me. There is a healing station here. Oh, it's a flappy thingy. Uh, see, this is what I meant about the Fear Explosion. And every time they fall to the ground, that's the server lag, so it becomes even more obvious what's going on here. Well, <laughs> that we're lagging. Ah, <laughs> uh, so there is... Phineas's old base. Uh, Phineas, RC, and Six... All, um, all moved away. Uh, with Poka loot, they wanted somewhere where they could get the loot. So they are about uh, 11,000 blocks away from here right now. <laughs> Leaving all of this stuff behind. Uh, I'm not raiding it or anything like that. I don't want to take their stuff. I'm assuming they're going to be moving it. Oh, Jesus, come on. Uh, but I am going to use his healer, which is up here. And that will be awesome. And then we will take a proper look at Memo Slime. Yeah, see, it did not restore itself, so I am thinking that it... Whoa. Am I really lagging that badly? Wow. Man. Look at all those dust balls. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm so happy. All right, let's take a peek. Let's get out here and do this proper. Oh god, that's gonna. Actually, you know what? Uh, I am gonna do something I don't normally do, guys. That doesn't look right. That looks a bit more right. Uh, 
All right. I am by the poke center I built. If you want to take a peek at the memo swine. Which should pretty much be to Osella because I don't think Rainbow's anywhere nearby. <laughs> All right, but let's let's do this for us here. Come on, don't be shy. Come on, guy. Oh, <laughs> oh! If we're crashing because of that. Oh, 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 oh. Oh yeah! Look at that. Oh, that's so awesome. <laughs> oh, can I ride him? Oh, I can't ride him. Oh, that would have been so awesome if I could. Look at that. That is so freaking cool. Let's move him down here. Uh, let's put him up in the uh, put him up in the central area. Mm -mm -mm. Right there, right there, buddy. Look at that. Look at you. Nothing's gonna stop you. You are going to be awesome. Stop jumping. <laughs> we might need to work on your house training a little. There we go. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> All right, so victory, guys. Let's see what Estella thinks. Oh oh oh. Oh, she's just healing her Pokemon. Mm, yeah. <laughs> All right. So I am very happy with this. This is a definite awesome find. Um, I will keep an eye out for a large one and a pygmy one. Uh, so maybe we will have a uh, a pinch hitter. But for now, this is actually just an ordinary sized one. <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm going to wrap up this episode uh, We mission accomplished it Yeah, yeah <laughs> He's like, alright, enough of that Enough, done <laughs> So thank you guys for watching uh, Maybe not one of my most exciting episodes But I am excited about it <laughs> Oh, she's got a baby on Nice <laughs> So I will catch you guys next time, and we will see what we're going to do then.